Business is full of ups and downs, so it helps to have a flexible way to pay. Try Business Essentials from O2 Business, the most flexible business tariff around. Hey guys, welcome to BTEC. Dan Basil, and this video is all about a PC that blows my mind. I'm not talking about the Acer Predator 17, even though it kind of blows my mind. The Surface Book, not what I'm talking about either, despite its stunning, stunning design. Oh no, this is all about the $35 Raspberry Pi 3. I'm gonna tell you a little bit more about this absolute beauty that actually is more mind-blowing than anything else we've got in this room in a lot of ways. Before I do, subscribe if you're not already subscribed to the channel. That's how you will stay on top of everything we do. Everything, including our branching out and covering cool stuff Stuff like this. So this is a Raspberry Pi 3. It is a full PC, fits between my th thumb and forefinger as you can see. Four USB ports, Ethernet out, HDMI out, 3.5 millimeter jack as well micro USB for power, a micro SD card slot, which is the entirety of the internal storage. And that's the crux of it. What's amazing about the Raspberry Pi 3 is the fact that you've got added Bluetooth and Wi-Fi as well. Plug this thing up, Bluetooth mouse even is supported. Um, thanks and Bluetooth keyboard from the off with a dongle and you will be absolutely laughing. This has a 1.2 gigahertz processor. It's an ARM processor, 64 bit. Cortex A53 um, and that's more powerful by 300 megahertz in terms of clock speed than its predecessor. So this will enable classrooms and even individuals who just want to get into Linux for a very very little money provided they have an external monitor to do just that. I'm going to talk you through the user interface but I felt that it was almost worth an entire video just on the hardware because it's so so small and I don't think people grasp how small it is. It's so inexpensive and yet it opens up so many possibilities. If you search the internet, there's even people who've installed Chromium, uh, kind of the open source take on Chrome OS onto Raspberry Pis in the past. Um, now that it's getting this additional open Wi-Fi and Bluetooth access, um, I'm really, really looking forward to seeing how the community just takes this forward. In the meantime, subscribe to the channel, like this video if you do, and watch out. Tomorrow we'll be bringing you a few user interface um, videos with the Raspberry Pi and Raspbian, an optimized version of Linux, specifically perfect for this little thing right here. If you've got any questions about it, anything you want us to try out ahead of us hooking it all up, fire them in the comments section below. Like this video, click like, like the channel, subscribe. It's how you will stay on top of everything that we do and it helps us out like crazy. Thanks for watching.